What is up guys, Parts Return of the OG Gamers here, and we got some good news. As of yesterday, Microsoft decided to do, everybody's calling it a 180, and they uh, re-thought their policies, because everyone was complaining, a bunch of people were complaining on Twitter, sharing posts on Facebook, and all around um, the social media network. It looks like Microsoft employees finally saw that cry, and they saw that PS4 was getting a lot more pre-orders than the Xbox One. So they decided to do a complete 180, as you see here, saying, let's try that again. Let's go up here. And now they have decided to remove their DRM bullcrap, where you cannot have used games. Um, no 24-hour check-ins anymore, so all you have to do is... One time, you only have to have the internet one time where you uh, set up the console and then after that you do not have to have internet ever again if you don't really want to. You can also, it's region free so you can take it to uh, other regions like different countries and stuff and you're, you'll be able to play it. As well as use games, you can borrow games, you can sell your games. Um, so GameStop was probably very happy about that. You can... Uh, like I said, you can sell your games and all stuff. They never say anything about backwards compatibility. Both of them are not backwards compatibility. But s some people are saying that um, Xbox is trying to use a cloud and then you're going to be able to transfer games over from your old Xbox by using the cloud. I'm not sure if that... That's a rumor. I'm not sure if that's confirmed. But you're probably going to have to pay a fee to uh, be able to have your old games, so... Yeah, so very good news that the Xbox is finally realizing that their customers were not going to buy their stupid bullcrap. Because as of when they announced that, I was PS4. I was like, okay, Xbox is being crappy right now. They're trying to be money-hungry whores. Sorry for my language. And I'm going to go with PS4. I already pre-ordered the PS4. I still have the PS4 pre-ordered. But the funny thing about it is when I went to... GameStop, I was going to order both, the pre-order both, but all the Xboxes are sold out. I don't, I don't, and PS4 was still available, so hopefully I can uh, pre-order the Xbox, and I'm, I'm glad they're removing their DRM thing. So now, I am an Xbox fan, I have always, I've had both consoles all the time, I've always had PS1, PS2, PS3. I've had Xbox Original and Xbox 360, but I prefer the Xbox because their online is better and their controller is better. But now that the PS4 is coming out, they're revamping their whole online experience. I'm not sure which one's going to be better. I know I still like the Xbox because I'm used to it. I'm planning on getting both, but we will see which one dominates over the other now that they're on a level playing field because of the DRM and not DRM thing. All right. Anyways, uh, tell me your your uh, thoughts in the comments, which console you're going to buy, and do these changes affect which console you're going to buy, and yeah, thanks for watching.